Hey guys, welcome back. Yesterday when I did a video for my, my second video for my customizations, the, one that, the ones that cost money, I talked about making a custom dice uh, or rolling area, right? Um, and I wanna call this the battle box. Now, it's, it's, it's really crude how it's made, okay? Don't pay attention to the quality of the workmanship, okay? This is the prototype. This is like to, kind of to, uh, you know, a sample, okay? So we can discuss here what things you like about it and things you don't like about it and then we can maybe uh, tweak the product a little bit or maybe you guys just hate it hate the idea and hate it and then I'm not even gonna try to build these things but uh, I just thought hey this is I'm gonna call this like I said the, the battle box now on this you know it has a lid of course now you're looking at it you know I can do all sorts of, of decorations on the on the on the on the woodwork uh you see my my custom piece boxes where i i inlay uh you know i inlay a piece in there right well we can you know there's always there's always something i i can do on these on these boxes um uh, not to mention you know different themes and, and paint schemes I, I will do on these but this is what i like about it now we're gonna have i want it to have a lid of course i don't know if it'll be hinged or not but either way It'll open up, okay? So now it has the dice. I'm thinking about, I want it to come with 40 hit dice, okay? So if you if you get this from me, I'm, I'm gonna see what I can do for the cost. I'm not gonna go through and dye them, but I'll order green, I'll order blue, order, and I'll tool them at the shop. So this will come loaded with 40 hit dice. I only have 38 in here because I got a, you know, like I said, it's, it's prototype, it's just a mock-up. It'll be right when I do the real thing. Of course, we'll have some sort of abacus here. Now this part here, because this is a higher wall, right? So this is the rolling area. I prefer this to be the, the rolling area. So this tray would just pop over here, you know, of course, and then you have room for all, uh, all your chips. And then here, since it, it's a higher wall, this would be the rolling area. And in here, I want to do leather bound just like I do mine. So it'll be padded walls here, uh, felt, and then leather. What that does is make it super, super quiet. Okay, it's great. And um, so we have that. You have now this. I want to have a choice of inserts. Um, I would like to do an insert that is this set up here, kind of. I mean, we, we can tweak it a little bit, like I said, but also have a scenario to house the chips. Okay, so if you have poker chips, and you don't want to use paper money, I can do some sort of insert that will work for that as as well. So this is it, man. This is uh this was my uh, my thought here of something I, I can I can produce to make it you know so everybody if you don't have a designated area to play your game and you're like me and you got to put your crap away, this is this is really handy, right? This is really you have dice, you have the abacus, you have a place for your money, a place for your uh, your uh, research and development tokens, if you use them. If not, you got a place for something else. Uh, this can even, we can even add dividers in here and um, a place for the chips. So uh, that's it, man. So uh, if you can just uh, leave me a comment and say, dude, it's cool, dude, it sucks. Uh, if you like it, why? If you hate it, why? And then other things, maybe you can, we can talk about, about tweaking it and this and that to make it more, um, desirable for you guys now obviously like i said i'll have different you seen the quality of my woodwork this will be in that same category like don't pay attention to my mock-up don't pay attention to things not being even and everything yeah i i did this like in an hour okay so don't pay attention to it it was it's for the purpose it's just for this video to say hey we can have a rolling area we have abacus we have dice not maybe come with dice maybe not come with dice i'm not sure but Obviously, you know, that would be cool if it did if you guys are interested in hit dice and then uh, like I said just a tray For uh, For this the only thing I'm having a problem with is just really you're gonna probably have to bag these You know and then just put, lay the bag in here because I really don't have a way to keep these from falling over You know, there's I don't really don't have, have a way to either the, either the dice is gonna fall if it's the other way or that's gonna fall so you might have to bag those lay a bag in here, you know, like a Ziploc bag or something. And then like I said, I don't know if this would this would hinge over 
or if you think it'd be easier if you guys had a choice well hey you can put this over here put this over here you know um, also if you needed two of them you really don't you know say you wanted a rolling area for this side of the table and a rolling area for that side of the table you probably don't need a space for double money so maybe uh, if you have an idea of a different uh, grid you know say you needed two right well you only need one with a grid like this right you don't need you're not gonna need two with all this stuff and some reason I'm stuck um, you're not gonna need two of these right you're gonna need one with this kind of stuff and maybe you, you'd want one with a different with a different setup maybe uh, I don't know um, cards maybe um, you know I, I don't know I don't know that, that's why this that's the point of this video to get your input on what I can do to make this better or uh, like I said if you just hate the whole idea in general that's totally cool too I only wasted an hour I didn't waste any money like I said I, I have access to a wood shop so you know it doesn't really cost me anything but time so, all right, guys, thank you much. Um, like I said, just leave me a comment. All right, guys, take care. Bye-bye. Oops, come on, baby. Turn off.